All right. Ugh, sorry about that. Ugh. All right, good. I thought my nose was bleeding. Space Marine that got lost in another universe. Oh, that would be great. Alright, let's see. This hits me downstairs. Who was over here? No one! A locked door. Cool. Alright. I have to go collect a bunch of side quests. I can't believe I landed a job here. This place gives me fits. Human delighted welcome. It is good to meet. All right, nothing in here except for. that and also a keeper this is where I came from isn't it yes okay okay this is the Turians area Commander Shepard I didn't expect to see you here did Ambassador Udina send you have we met before no but I know you well enough I'm Executor Palin, head of CSEC. It's my job to know when someone like you arrives on the Citadel. Was there something you needed, Commander? I get the feeling you're not too fond of humans. No, I just don't trust you. Play the game extremely xenophobic. <laughs> you humans are eager to take all the power you can get, and you're being given a lot. If the Council wants to make humanity their new favorite pet, that's their business. But I don't have to. What do you know about the Spectres? They're the right hand of the Council, or so they like to be called. More like the underhand inside of the Council. What do you have against the Spectres? I can't abide any organization that considers itself above the law. Especially when it's left up to each individual Spectre to decide when and how to bend the rules. Tell me about CSEC. CSEC provides necessary police and security services throughout the Citadel. We're a civilian government agency, though many of our members have had military training. Of course, as the CSEC representative to the Council, I spend most of my time liaising between the two. Tell me about your investigation into Saren. Sorry, Commander. I don't make a habit of giving out details about ongoing investigations. Well, I could have hoped that you would have given me the information. I'll be going now. Goodbye, Commander. Also, talking to these people all have a purpose, because the more I talk to them and learn about their history, I gain codex, and that means I get, uh, experience. So I'm actually serving a purpose here, not just lore building. Following message transmitted in engineer. You have been selected to receive the transmission. Join us, he now only has a body. Huh. Alright then. Ah, here we go. This place seems strange. Don't believe the rumors. The consort would never reveal her secrets. Yeah, I can, but the way that it works is like this. So you see how it has, like, triangle marks here? To denote other upgrades? You don't really get to be able to hack something better until you hit these milestones. So, if I were to put three points into here, expend an entire level up to do that, it wouldn't really amount to much. It would just give me increased damage to uh, electronics, whereas hitting another tick would do it better. So, it's easier to just to piece it out. As long as you get this last one, you'll be able to hack anything you need. Yeah, 
the same for the same goes for description as well or uh, decryption as well. So you don't necessarily need a maxed out bar to be able to uh, 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 to uh, break things open. Also, we're still super early game, and I know where most of the side quests are, so it won't be a problem leveling up. What do you want? Oh, Commander. Is there something I could do it's... for you? Relax, Private. This isn't an inspection. Right. Sorry. What can I do for you, This voice sounds really familiar. What can you tell me about the Asari consort? I, uh... Well, she's an Asari who works here as... That is, she helps people with things. You never want to see her, did you, Fredericks? I, uh... No. Uh, I yeah, go ahead. I see if you can find him. He's just a minor character. Just a... But he's listed as Fredericks. Can you at least tell me where I can find her? Sure. She's across the bridge from the embassies. Thanks, kid. Have fun. Try not to get into too much trouble. I will. Have fun, that is. But he sounds super familiar, but I can't place him. Hello, Commander. Can I get you something? What have you got? Cam Clark. Information mostly. Doesn't sound familiar. I'd like to know about some points of interest nearby. What's going on around here? Well, you found the embassies. Not much going on here. Across the bridge, you'll find the bank, the Emporium, and Shaira's. If you haven't heard of her, you soon will. If you need supplies, you can try the markets one level below. For entertainment, I'd try Flux or Cora's Den. What is Shaira's? Kagerosa Inaba. I don't even know who that is. Most of the diplomats and ambassadors have visited her at one time or another. She's a very Someone video game wise. Is Liquid Snake. Okay, respected. that makes. Okay, that's why I recognize his voice. Okay, Liquid. I know. Also, hi, Fluffy. <laughs> it's not over yet. Goodbye. So long, Commander. Have a pleasant day. <laughs> ah, I've never played any of the Tales of games. I don't have time to talk now. I'm oh, I wasn't busy. trying to. Oh, okay, that's her talk talking. Now. Okay. Oh, right, right. Most of them won't talk to me until I'm a, f until I'm a, specter. Right, 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 right. I should probably go get that whole business taken care of first before I try, uh, picking up most of the side quests. I forgot. I'm still just a marine captain. Not Marine Captain, but just a commander. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow me to be your guide. That makes sense. I can see that. Alright, to Citadel Tower. Ugh. Get introduced to the best character of the game. Saren's hiding. There something. you are. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council. Don't be ridiculous. Okay, yeah, I can. Yeah, I'd recognize that as Weasel. All right, I could see that. Commander Shepard, Garrus Vicarian. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. Sounds like you really want to bring him down. I don't trust him. Something about him rubs me the wrong way. But he's a specter. Everything he touches is classified. I can't find any hard evidence. I think the council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you.
<laughs> you know what we should do? Not recruit Rex. Because that sounds like a brilliant idea. The hearing's already started. Come on. The Geth attack is a matter of some concern, but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. The investigation by <laughs> <Citadel> <laughs> security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow Spectre and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson, you always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. The mission to Eden Prime was top secret. The only way you could know about the beacon was if you were there. With Nihilus gone, his files passed on to me. I read the Eden Prime report. I was unimpressed. But what can you expect from a human? Saren despises humanity. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that. That's not his decision. Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. The humans are I gotta say, I still like that quote. That one's still, still one of my favorite. This meeting has no purpose. Saren's hiding behind his position as a specter. You need to open your eyes. What we need is evidence. So far, we've seen nothing. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. This meeting is adjourned. It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. <sighs> He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. Tell me about this history between you and Saren. I worked with Do the Council members long die long during the course of the game? Things they like can. That. Real bad. Mass Effect is one of those games where it's like your decisions actually matter and will affect the course of the game to one extent or the other. The council dying is something that can happen. Ultimately, though, it doesn't make much of a change except for something that won't take effect till the third game. What's our next step? As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that loser. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. You can't just cut Captain Anderson out of this investigation. The Ambassador's right. I need to step aside. 
I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. Is the audio still good, oh, by the way? Probably getting drunk at Cora's Den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. Maybe there's another way to find evidence against Saren. You should talk to Barla Vaughn over in the financial district. Rumor has it he's an agent for the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? An information dealer. Buys and sells secrets to the highest bidder. I've heard Barla Vaughn's one of the top mm -hmm. representatives. He might know something about Saren. But his information won't come cheap. All right, so uh, what's up with what's Udina's deal? He's just a stick in the mud. He's a politician. That's really all I have to say to sum up his character, at least in the first game. You and Saren have a history. What happened? About 20 years ago, I was part of a mission in the Skillian Verge. I was working with Saren to find and remove a known terrorist threat. Saren eliminated his target. But a lot of people died along the way. Innocent people. And the official records just covered it all up. But I saw how he operates. No conscience. No hesitation. He'd kill a thousand innocent civilians to end a war without a second thought. Killing innocents doesn't end You'll wars. You'll see. It causes them. I know how the world works, Commander. Sometimes you're forced to make unpleasant decisions. But only if there's no other way. Saren doesn't even look for another option. He's twisted, broken. He likes the violence, the killing. And he knows how to cover his tracks. Killing innocents doesn't end wars. It causes them. I know how the world works, but only if there's no other way. I Saren should go. Good luck, Shepard. Be... Alright. Okay, I have not leveled up yet. All right, uh, let's see. All right, so we're not a Spectre yet, which means I can't do all the fun stuff. Also, you don't have to worry about that. What guy? The one over by the keeper. Oh god, I can take this side quest. What? Oh, no, I wasn't. Never mind. Um, yes, is there something you want? Why are you so interested in the Keepers? Keepers? I've got no interest in the Keep- Don't get coy. I know what I saw. I, uh... I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. We're just talking. Is there something wrong with that? No. I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I'm using a small scanner to gather readings on the Keepers. So far I've had mixed results. I find it difficult to get near the creatures. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Well, technically, we're not supposed to disturb the Keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. I'd like to do it more openly, but it's not really worth getting arrested over. I could help you out. I'm not worried about the authorities. I don't even know who you are. I'm Commander Shepard with the Alliance Military. Hmm. Well, I, I suppose I could use the help. You'll need this. It's the scanning device I developed. Activate it each time you see a keeper. All collected data will automatically upload to my database. I'll even send a few credits your way for each unique scan. I should get going then. Yes, I have much work myself. So long, and good luck with the scanning. So I don't remember if I finished it, but I was getting cut off. Uh, we don't have to worry about the ambassador thing until, like, literally the end of the game. <laughs> All right, now it's time to play my favorite game. It's time to remember if I know where all the keepers are. No, I'm waiting to speak with Commander. All right, I can't speak to him until I'm a Spectre, right? I forget how many keepers are in the game. Well, serves as a good excuse to walk around. Nah, it's fine. It's not that important.
And seriously, it's a good excuse to uh, walk around the Citadel, other what? Uh, otherwise, we'd just be fast traveling all around to hit the major points. Was it a new recipe? not disturb the keepers greetings and welcome to the presidium my name is Avina and I am pleased to be your virtual guide throughout this level of the Citadel space station so are you a person or a program I am a fully interactive virtual intelligence program to provide spontaneous guidance at predetermined locations of interest throughout this level of the Citadel I may also be contacted through any of the presidium VI terminals should you require assistance. Give me the tour. You are standing at Presidium Tourism Terminal 2, located at the base of the Citadel Tower, one of the most recognizable and important features of the Presidium. To your left is one of the Keepers, the enigmatic caretakers of the Citadel, working on a control panel. You may see Keepers involved in various tasks throughout all levels of the Citadel. We ask that you do not interfere with them in any way. The Keepers are essential to the smooth operation of the Citadel. Obstructing their daily work will result in harsh penalties, including incarceration and rehabilitation. Comforting. That's all for now. Thank you for using Athena. Have a pleasant day. Anyone else hear that low hum? Sounds like it's coming from that statue. Makes my teeth tingle. Uh, let's see. Who else can I talk to around here? I forget. I was gonna say, actually, what part am I at? Uh, is this who I need to... Yep, here we go. This is the guy. What's this? One of the Earth Clan. Ah, a very famous one, yes? You are the one called Shepard. You were at Torfin, correct? You led the final assault against the enemy base, if memory serves. You've got me at a disadvantage here. Forgive me, Earth Clan. My name is Barla Vaughn. My job makes it necessary for me to keep informed. I am a financial advisor to many important clients here on the Citadel. When someone as important as yourself arrives on the station, I take notice. Noted. Cool. I want information. I heard you work for the Shadow Broker. Do you have any information about Saren? You're very blunt, Shepard. But you're right. I am an agent for the Shadow Broker. And I do know something about Saren. I hear your information can be expensive. Normally, this information would cost a small fortune, but these are exceptional circumstances, so I am going to give it to you for free. What's the catch? There is no catch. The Shadow Broker is quite upset with Saren right now. They used to do a lot of business. Just goes to show, don't Saren piss off your information brokers. That's what happens when you deal with a traitor like Saren. No matter what you think of Saren, he's not stupid. He knows the Shadow Broker is a valuable ally. 
turning on him doesn't make sense. Not unless something huge was at stake. I don't know the details, but the Shadow Broker hired a freelancer to deal with it. A Krogan mercenary. How do I find him? I heard he was paying Citadel Security a visit. If you hurry, you can probably catch him before he leaves the CSEC Academy. Thanks for the info. My pleasure. <laughs> Bitchin. Now I have to remember where CSEC Academy is. Uh... <laughs> first things first, though. Uh, I have to talk with the jellyfish. Ah, human. This one is greatly pleased to see you here in my decadent emporium. Who are you? This one's face name is Della Minder, though many in this place simply refer to it as Della. Please take time to examine the fine goods it has for purchase, all of great worth. Why do you refer to yourself as this one and it? For the same reason that humans are so inquisitive. It is part of our culture. Uh, you didn't miss much. Specifically, Hanar only refer to themselves in the first person with family or intimates. And we rarely do so with other species. It is just our way. Oh, wait, I already asked this one. This Please take time to examine the fine goods it has for purchase. Show me your items. Oh, this one is pleased to do so, human. You will not be disappointed. Let's see what do we got here. I like Turian armor. Oh wait, these are non-human armors. I'm stupid. I can't equip any of this crap. <laughs> Basically, we've got information and it's going to lead us to uh, some things. Oh, right there. Oh, right, the Krogan. Oh, a keeper. That <laughs> thing with the stuff with the thing? Yeah, that kind of stuff with the thing. Oh, wait, there's another fucking keeper over there. I have to go scan it. I have to compulsively go touch it. Oh, okay, that's where this is. Welcome, I am Nalina. I don't recognize you as one of our expected clients today. Would you like me to see when the consort will be able to meet with you? Can't I just go in? Mm, I'm afraid not. Yeah, you must understand there are many who seek the consort services. But if you wish to leave your name, she'll make every effort to meet All right. you. Commander Shepard, with the Alliance Navy. Excellent. You should hear something in... Um, three or four months. Nobody's worth that much of a wait. <laughs> well, that's not for me to judge. I have your name and you'll be contacted. Is there anything else? What is the consort? What does she do? Mm, it's difficult to explain. She's many things to many people, and something different for each. Some seek her for advice, some for entertainment, others still for pleasure. Most of the time, our clients won't realize what they were seeking until after she is provided that it That sounds them. vague as shit. You make her sound like some kind of oracle. No, not in the usual sense. She's merely a woman. A woman with remarkable compassion and a generous spirit. I suggest you make an appointment and see for yourself. What do you do here, Nalina? I'm one of the consort's acolytes. 
Many of the people here today will not see the consort, but they expect to be attended to just the same. It's our job to ensure that they leave contented. Uh... What exactly do you attend to? Well, each acolyte has her unique abilities. Some soothe with song, others with conversation. As much as possible, we seek to match the needs of our clients to the skills of our acolytes. My specialty is touch. My fingertips can find every tension point in your body and relieve it. Go on! I'd like to try out your services. Excellent. I'll add you to our client list. We should be able to see you in... Mm, three or four months. Alright. I think I'm done here. Oh, well, I hope you'll return again in the future. We always enjoy seeing new clients. Nalina. Yes, Shaira? Send the commander up to see me. I wish to speak with her. Yes, of course, mistress. Huh. It appears the consort has taken notice of you. She'd like to meet with you now. <laughs> yeah, that's not suspicious or odd. Where do I go? Just head upstairs. She'll be waiting for you. <laughs> 